founded in 1853 by two brothers, George Henry Lee and Henry Boswell Lee Jr. George Henry Lee's quickly evolved from a bonnet warehouse to a prestigious department store. In 1874, control passed to Thomas Oakslot, who became the first tradesman to be named Lord Mayor of Liverpool in 1887, adding to the store's prestige. By 1910, with over 1,200 employees, George Henry Lee underwent a grand transformation boasting elegant Edwardian marble pillars on its Bastnet Street frontage. However, after the First World War, the Oakslot family sold the store to H. Gordon Selfridge, an American businessman. The store's exclusivity dwindled under Selfridge's management. In 1940, George Henry Lee found new ownership within the John Lewis Partnership along with other stores in Selfridge's Provincial Stores Group. Well, anyway, you didn't come here to watch me ramble. You came here to, to look and explore. All right, so let's get to it. So good. I've got walk through shoes. Oh shit. E, what is that like? Um, it's like oil or something like that. How flooded? How flooded is it? Because I can walk up to a certain amount. It's like a puddle. This shit. Lift. There's lift stuff down here. Didn't think they'll have that. Yeah, there's a big lift thing. Don't know why they'd have that in here. <laughs> oh shit, Ed. I just took a fucking <laughs> long exposure there, Baxton. Open. Yeah, it's in the shop. Can't be asked. Yeah, look at all this um machine what what is this all for here? Eh? Is that oh that's another lift? Yeah, yeah, it's a lift like that. It's weird like um mum was chatting how uh, 
I mean, this place, it seemed like they had like 10 lifts and 10 different sets of stairs and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah. So, and when I looked around, it kind of did. It's one of, one of, a Santa, one of those up one of the staircases. Is there? Yeah, yeah. To be fair, the condition of the rest of the building, this is like quite a decent basement. I know, yeah. Whoa, shit, look at that thing. That's weird. Where? Whoa, shit. Don't breathe that in, that one. Don't like the floor there. There's a lot of vinyl stuff in it. Yeah, it's soft. Yeah, it's like a vinyl in it. So far. Why the fuck is it buzz? Yeah, I was just thinking. Like, <laughs> do not. Wait, Powerland? Maybe. Uh, yeah, it most probably is Powerland. Or maybe they've just got it still kind of half running. Oh, yeah, okay, I think. Gear oil? That's smart, that. Mate, look at all the stuff that's left. Yeah, the, lad, there's some rooms in this building, I'm telling you, there's some mad shit that's left of the hard hat there as well. Oh shit, yeah. They have fuses down there, big fucking fuses. Yeah, probably um, something to do with that, isn't it? Look at those fuses there. Yes, 88 to 1952. 200 amps. Wow. Why is there just a load of different plugs and light switches and stuff like that? Yeah, well, it must probably, this is probably where they tested like broken equipment on Oh, you are, yeah. Oh, yeah, so do you know in the shop if they yeah. had something broken? Obviously, you have different countries and all that, so they have different country well, they're sockets. All, they're all just British, but they're. Oh, like, are they? That's a f f three, two amps, that's a five amps, that's a 15, but that's like huh? pre 1950s. Wow. It's old. God, when there's fresh coils of cable. How many cable, drill marks are in the desk? When there's fresh fucking coils of cable, you know that this place is fresh. Yeah, because copper in it. That's the first thing that someone would take. Nothing in there. To be honest with you, good desk that. It's a decent little table, on it? Yeah. We do the top. I'd nick that. <laughs> there's another door there, you know. Alright, uh, yeah, don't want to split up too fast. George! George! Oh shit. Hey George! Whoa, look how much random shit is in here. Is there? Yeah, it's just full of shit. What the fuck? Oh, this place is weird. This place is weird, you know. Oh, it's like, you know, back rooms. It's like the back rooms. It's, like, it's just like a load of like Everton scarves and stuff like that, and Liverpool scarves. Yeah. Brace of reels, regulation, so health and safety stuff. Look at the oh, lads, look at the copper there. Shit. Ah, oh, that's worth a bit of money. Yeah, lads, I know you're tempted and all, <laughs> like electrician, but like. Oh god, that's a, that's a substation. So that's where bugs are coming from. That's weird, that. It's so weird how they have an actual gen, like, substation here. I know, for the fucking building. Yeah, but that must be going to other buildings as well, mustn't it? Battery warning. That's yeah. fucked. That's that's on. Battery warning, yeah. battery failure. It says phase failure as well, yeah. so it means that there's no power. So oh, that's good. Alright. <laughs> yeah, right. yeah. There's a room back here. I just wanted to have a look at. What the fuck's that? 
Intercom. It's, an, it's a two-station intercom. Yeah. There's old boxes here. Isolators, isolator. This equipment here. There's a wind. Is that window? Loud. I swear you can. Lad, I think that goes Poundland. Is it bored? Yeah, it's bored. It must go. That'll go directly into Poundland, man. Because you can hear the music playing, can't you? Well, it's the fell outside, isn't it? Oh, I don't shit. think they have a live band. Yeah. <laughs> Imagine that. Oh, what's that? What's that thing? Is that a drill or something like that? Looks like a big drill, isn't it? Yeah. Odd. What's in that? There's, there's coats. There's literally fucking coats. Yeah, lads, that's... Oh, like, um, a technician coat. Yeah, yeah. That's fucking insane. Oh, lad, that's sick, though. I'd wear that. It is, isn't it? It's like fucking... What's, what's in there? I'm not sure. Like a chimney or a boiler or something like that. Yeah, oh, shit, that's so weird. It's a, it's a vent. That's the... So you see this thing here? This must be for ventilation. This is a big fan, isn't it? Oh shit, look at this old isolator. Wait, what date is it on that? Uh, made in England. Uh, don't know, I don't say. Oh, was it? Yeah. Wow. But it was, I, think it was, I think it was open back in 2014. Look at this cable, man. Yeah, probably. I was that's, in... That's aluminium cable, that. I, can't I think I was in year 4, 2014. Oh, fucking hell, man. Jesus. Oh, this place is... Yeah, no, mate. <laughs> oh, yeah, it probably will. It's the building's massive. I I had I had like a run around with it. Didn't have like a um, proper mad look, but it is massive. It's huge. Shit files. International camera. Oh. <laughs> I could send you the footage to be honest. With. Printer cartridges still in the room box. Do you watch how really? Oh, it's alright, it's alright. Yeah. Shit. You can hear people walking in Parliament above. Below pal, yeah. what the fuck? Isn't, that's fucking crazy. Isn't that it? is, lad, they're getting fucking. <laughs> lad, this isn't. <laughs> so this is how you do a heist to Powerland. Yeah, if you want to be a terrorist and do a terror, yeah, yeah. A terror attack on Powerland, then, um, yeah. It's not even Powerland anymore, is it? <laughs> Same as them. No, it, no, it's Powerland, I think. Pretty well, sure. Is it even a pound? <laughs> no, it's not a pound, it's a pound twenty. Probably no. These fucking scarves. You know the people outside who sell the evidence cars and stuff like that? Ah, yeah. There you go, lad. Free, free little shop here. Treasure, Liverpool. Everton <laughs> carpets. Lad. If you're if you into like football and that, this is your, this is your dream location, innit? I just explore. Can't, ste I can't step on the, the England fog. Captain shit over there. Whoa. Shit, this is this is bizarre, isn't it? Yeah. Eighty percent okay. off. Don't switch him. <laughs> that might be the, the fuses for the alarm. <laughs> What's enough? Just switch him. I still need to find where all the pumps and shit are that we've got on now. Oh look. What's that? Manny's little help or something like that? This looks... This is the only room that looks remotely crashed. Lads! It is. 100, 175th anniversary of the... What's that? Summit of Liverpool. Summit City of Liverpool. Mugs there. In, in the packaging as well. 
and a football shoe, money bank. Wow. Keys. So weird. Why is this place so messy in here? Because obviously, like the obviously, I like, call the copper cables are still there and all that. It's like trashed, but it probably is. It wasn't. Yeah, it's probably like one set of people who work there or some part. Yeah. Lad, look at that. Right, that's just a box full of books. Twenty nineteen, though. Twenty nineteen. I thought this. Two thousand. Probably been used as, uh, for storage at some point. Won it by by Poundland or something. Yeah, could be. Because because. Uh, Raise the DIY shop, why would they have all this stuff? John Lennon, yeah, yeah. John Lewis mean, John Lennon, uh, why would they have all this stuff? They wouldn't, would they? Shit. Yeah, yeah, this place is insane. Lads. Is this a bolly? It's just a full on bolly. <laughs> This place is insane. I'm going in there. I'll just go back. What's up here? Oh, That's a storage oh, room or something. Yeah. What is the stairs? Yeah. Oh, more stairs. Yeah, there's, these are stairs. These go right up to the top. They go down. Oh, Lad, I, I, down. I, this is the stairs. I took a photo of and sent it here. And I said the basement's deeper than I think. So I'm right. And I thought it was an optical illusion a second ago, but never mind. Holy shit. Oh, why is it cloudy in here? Are you vape? Yeah. Yeah, thank God. Oh my God, look at all this. I don't want to be a gas leak. Oh! There for building shells with. Look at that door. Look at that door. Bye! Big wooden door. Oh, look, that's sealed off there. Maybe. Yeah. What's there? Be careful if open the door, though. I don't think there's any lights on. I think the handles have been taken off. Nope. I think it's been screwed shut. It's been screwed shut on it. Mm. They've, ri they've ripped off the uh, the handles. That's a weird little. See that there? Uh, little hatch. A white hatch. And they've got a load of coal at the bottom. So maybe they had some kind of coal furnace down here. And they're, they're dropping, so, so that goes to street level somewhere. Yeah. And they're just dropping coal down the chute. What does this say? Manchester cal um, clarifiers. <laughs> wow. It's in there. Careful, might still be on. <laughs> no, I don't think it is. Though. Shit. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, asbestos for a knife. Thanks for exposing us to a load of asbestos. Close it back up.
Of kanaal. Oh. Wait, this is this isn't even the deepest level, is it? <laughs> Fucking hell. Is this the deepest level? We've already done that before. No, we haven't. Not down here. No, that's the No, no, we haven't been down here. This is this is the level four blow. Shit, where do those doors go? Check those all upset. Close it again. That's that, that thing, oh shit, we have been down there. Yeah. Lads, you're right, fucking them minds. Yeah. <laughs> Run around the circle there. How did, wait, how did we miss this door? I came, I came, when you went the way out for this way. Alright. Have you seen what's through these? Looks like it's someone's... Head. Are these like locked then? Someone's like... Yeah, it's just cupboards or something, I think like that. Yeah, well I was going to bring a tripod, but it's going to be arse, because it's uh, weight in that. Oh, I know how to get to the, the roof of this place, at the top highest point. Yeah, and, and it's, it's great. There's a lot of bird shit up there, but it's alright. Oh, is that an office? Oh, might be able to go to them. I think it's glass that they can Wait, can we... Oh. Yeah, that's a bit stiff. Yeah, they had one of the fire exit there, so maybe they were just using that as an entrance. Or, t or temporary entrance, maybe. Yeah, unlocked at all times, fire exit. Yeah, it's so far. It goes further than that, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, like the camera's tight. What's the fuck? Oh, shit. What the fuck? Oh, I've got a fucking. I'm gonna just shoot JPEG. Why the fuck am I shooting that? Why does it take so <sighs> Ah, what the fuck's going on with that?
Lads, what the fuck? I thought that wasn't one of those strings, you know then. <laughs> Fucking idiot me. There we go, fucking finally. Camel's being a fucking nightmare then. Yeah, yeah. Lad, what the fuck? Just, a uh, lad, I turned the fucking flash off. I just went up. I'm gonna clean me, um... Me, uh, thing. Just turn me camera off for a second. I don't, I, I, yeah, because my mum never went in, into it when it was vapid. But she, but we went into it when it was John Lewis, so, yeah. Yeah, this place is kind of insane. Oh shit, is that light? Is that, so do you know John Lewis or something, or DRI shops for that? That's where they had the, the light display or something, I think. You know, for the lights. And it would have had like all the lights hanging over here. <laughs> That's mad. They had a lot of set on. It's got Whoa! Oh, this the uh, lift. <laughs> wow! Wow! With lights off, it's quite spooky. Hmm. What is there? Anything down there? No, it's just seawater. Oh, are you? Oh wait, lads! You know the sealed door that, I, that we went through before that was in the, the air ventilation room? Yeah, yeah. That's what that is? Uh, is it? Yeah. Yeah. This must have been light, yeah, this must have been light section then. <laughs> like how they have the, the broom, they mopped it all with. <laughs> well, I, I read on that, I know that they're wrapping the coat, you've got to like, clean your everything before the shop. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. When did you read that? I was just Googling it yesterday. Oh, fair enough. Phone charging, so. It's weird, aren't it? Oh shit, look at these. Mm -hmm. These caters. Why is that Astro turf now? <laughs> yeah. Why is it Astro turf? up here. Football. A game of football in there. Sansa up here. Oh, you got another one. I wonder if there's a story. I wonder if there's a story about that, like someone went round, put them all around. 
it's not. Wait. No, it can't be. When it was that's not. I can't. Yeah, this guy's does. No, I can't. Palons are not. Oh, black mold's a nice one. Yeah, nice black mold that. Want some soup? Oh, look at that. Oh shit, what's that? Is that a phone case? Not I thought it was like a tape some part. Yeah. Oh, okay. Knock it. Some lad it's telling you now there's some mad treats in the upper floors. It's there. Oh yeah. Do you know what's a fucking proper shame? This building's really getting worse for it now. Yeah, it's gonna it's gonna come to a point where it's cost the point of um, but well, it's just cheaper to knock it down. Yeah, because it's a proper ass destroyed. Yeah, it, it's water damage, lads. It's leaking everywhere. Yeah. And it, and if you think about it, it's prime prime like property in it really. I told you on Palon, we're just down there, weren't we? That's under the other building. Yeah, that's that building's abandoned as well, but um, it's all bricked off. Yeah, why? Well, it don't matter. Do you probably think we're meant to be? <laughs> no. Shit. Yeah, that's probably the best idea not to do that. What should we do now? Do you want to go to one of the upper floors and just hide?
Wow, das ist gerade bigger. This is a weird room. Yeah, it's strange that it's, it's like a um, yeah staff room or something. I think. I think it was like a room where it was. Yeah, it might have been a staff room though. People must have got on on into this building originally to the roof. Yeah, you reckon? Because there's graffiti. There's only graffiti. Maybe the whole block. Oh shit, lads. Please. Uh, canteen key. Are we gonna be like one of the door key? One of the first people doing this, no? There's no, oh. there's no photos. Yeah, there's no photos of them lying. Other than that, in the art gallery, yeah. Oh, lad. This is like proper, proper, proper urbex, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Like, like you know, like what we were doing, we we're just taking well, photos of the, what, of what. The sinks aren't smashed. Yeah. <laughs> it's fucking crazy. It's a bit weird recording in the toilet. Yeah. <laughs> wow, an abandoned toilet. <laughs> uh. I was the video one. Yeah, we, we came up with these. Yeah, yeah, they don't see Oh, yeah, the generator. Yeah, oh, is that where the generator is? Yeah, generator's down in down there. Is that what's the spell then? That's the building, that's the other side of it. So we're gonna try and get in there later. Um have a look anyway. I yeah. think that was I think I found the land on the model with John Lewis, but I'm not even sure because there's No, I think it was John I think it was John uh, Lewis. Well was it still? Yeah, my mum said it went do you know TK Max? That used to be the front entrance of John Lewis. Um, and he used to go all the way back. Look at these got... machines here. They're safes as well. Um no the wind is next one. Over here, I think. Is it? No, floor blow. F floor blow. Yeah, it'll be floor blow. Second floor, isn't it? Do you know what? They probably have actions at the centre because they're not the pigeons there. Because the pigeons must set that problem up all the time. Oh ah uh, yeah. What do you think of that? Yeah, alright. Oh, we're fucking sound. Yeah, this is an interesting bit over here with the um, with the boards, because we've like boarded it off. So the possible entrance is to crawl through on the holes here. Yeah, that might be an entrance, you know. It looks really hard to do. Yeah. There might be an entrance there, but there's loads of shelves and stuff like that in the way, so you might have to push them out of the way, which I don't know how how you're really meant to do it. Yeah. So, yeah, try the roof. Yeah, this is mad, isn't it? It's actually got like an alright zoom this. So I think it's only, what's it, five times? 5.1 millimetre to 25.5 millimetre. Can you just hold this? That's what I hate, like I can't have to close this up again. It's actually sick though. Yeah, yeah. and it's got, it's, got a, it's got an L blocker on it, so. Yeah, yeah. I used to never like have that and then I do. Yeah, well decent, isn't it? Yeah. Thank you. There you go. Yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get mine out in a, in a bit later on, I think. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> People buying fucking um 
What's it? So you're going to pound that later, just to fucking <laughs> yeah, have a laugh. Yeah, yeah. Just walk in and be like, oh, we've just been all around we've your just building. We've just been there. We've just been all around your building. I wonder if there was a time where it won't build buzzed up from Powerland. Yeah, because that used to be the I'm not, imagine, imagine, lad, imagine it being break and you're just coming up here. I know, I might. Are you fucking mad though? It's, it's not closed, it's just like a lock, but it's like a big fucking padlock. Ah. Uh. This is the only bit I can remember coming because I remember that one shape and it being in that. Weird. Yeah, this is weird, isn't it? I remember uh, last time I was like got about to get out and I saw this place yeah. and I heard like a tiny noise and I was just oh. like, oh, I can't be honest. Oh, no. Goods too heavy to manage. Very nice. Oh shit! Look at the fridge. It's insane that. I wish there was a button and it would just like turn flash on. So you just press it, flash on, press it, flash off, instead of fucking having to fanny around. It's the was on my own on camera. Yeah. Oh really? Well that's good. There was like auto flash, auto flash off. Is that it on this time? Oh no, that isn't, but you can oh. you can just shut the flash down and it doesn't pop off. Oh that's good. Oh shit. Yeah, it, it, on my cannon it just fucking pops up all the time, it's pissed me off. Yeah. I think I need a wider lens now. <laughs> yeah. Really tight, aren't you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get that. Sony 20. I want to get a really wide lens. It's good for like shit like this. Fisheye lenses are cool. Yeah, I like fisheye. Yeah. Maybe get that Sony 20G. Do you know the stairs there? They go straight down to Palmont. Uh, obviously it's buzz up in a way or something like that, but yeah. Decent little light camera to be honest with. Quite sharp lens. Mad place. Have you seen those bikes then? Yeah. Yeah, that's very good. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I do is the computer locked? Yeah, oh lad, there's about 50 Windows computers 7. in one room. Is there? Windows yeah, 7. Yeah, there's like loads. Windows. Nick it, <laughs> nick it and just oh, get a free computer. Oh, there you go. Just put that to your light. Let's just see. David uh, Setsky. Hey, what's the computer? Oh, there's computers in here. I haven't been in there, I don't think. No, nah, I haven't been in there. Oh shit. Oh, I don't know how I've not been here. Wow. For sale? What? Why is it for sale? Yeah. Like customs there. It was probably when they went into liquidation and they just try and sell everything. Fucking hell, that'll be worth a few bob, though. Oh, will it? Yeah, that's what Shit, I almost just fucking broke a light. Wow. 
Wow, slow files. Oh shit, look at those photos there. What's that? Have you seen the photos behind here? Behind all the shit, which is probably spiders or what on it, but. Just the photos, but. Oh shit, there. yeah. Ah, fucking tea bags, isn't it, bro? Well, don't nick a tea bag. You know, up into Ali Law, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> George Hunter. Look at all the fucking copy, copy. Yeah. Windows XP professional. <laughs> look at that screen there, look how thin it is and like, it's old isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's like an old little flat screen thing. It's kind of mad stuff in there, little skeleton key looking things. Wow. Yeah, but the case might be good. Window keys or something. Oh, no, the Pokemon cards. I wonder if that's worth anything. Ask my sister if that's any worth anything because she's into all Pokemon, little nerd. <laughs> this has got HDMI on it. Really? Yeah. What, what graphics card does it have? It doesn't have graphics card. Ah. Uh, on board. board graphics, shit else. That looks quite new though. Take it. <laughs> just walk out, will it? Only joking! That's on records, only joking. But like, it's fucking crazy, when have you ever been in it? Best independent retailer. <laughs> Clearly not shut. <sure. laughs> and they can also oh, yeah. just have everyone can see. Rapid response, my husband and I over the last six months, uh, so we've shot for random items and rapid. Oh shit else. Shit up break. Is it? The only good? Nah. Ah. Well, do you have like all the certificates and shit like that? Do you these they're like original certificates as well? This is literally like someone went home and just even back. Yeah. Please pay here. Yep. It's like someone, someone like had a bad day at work in it, and was like, ah, oh, yeah. just got a phone shit everywhere, and then fucked off. Honestly, it's like mad on us just so much. There's not on the shop floor, but there's just so much behind the scenes. Lad, how? How the fuck can I take a long exposure on this? It's not even blurry. Wow. That's mad, bad, isn't it? That's actually bad. Let me just get a photo of the last one. Skybox. Turn it, I'll turn on flash. Minolta battery charger. Minolta battery charger. Oh, for a camera? Mm -hmm. Oh, shit. Yeah. Lad, that's actually sick though. Where's the camera? Does the battery charge it? That'd be cool if I won't it? Yeah. Oh, wouldn't it be sick to, take, to put an SD card in, in the camera if it's got charge? Take a few snaps in it. Just leave it. Yeah, yeah. And obviously, like, you know, not stay on the camera in it. Yeah. I think it's just like outside of my head if you call it. Yeah. Should be. Bizarro. Bizarro Waro. Oh shit. Are those like the owners or not?
Beautiful spell of old. Tash, you fucking mad. Oh yeah, I saw that. Careful alarm skin. Because I don't think pigeons come down here. Yeah. Shit, what's that? It's like an attic space. Yeah, yeah you see that? Shit, yeah. no. Oh, careful. Oh, shit. Probably quite rugged though. Yeah, anything around here or not? You can't get to it, it's all just fucking double. Come on, dude, just take your hands. Where is it? That's bizarre. Look good. <laughs> Very stupid little cam moment off my head. I, I hate, I, that's the only thing I hate about like GoPro action camera. I got a twat wearing it. It's that a stage. A bit high though for a stage. Yeah, it's, no, it's a bit too high for a stage, isn't it? Maybe. The fire roses are sick. I know, they are, aren't they? Yeah. That's probably the middle floor, isn't it? Um, yeah. Do you explore that one? Yeah, I think so. And maybe not on some of the rooms on the fringes, because we walked straight up, didn't we? So there's probably a few rooms we might have missed. There's defo a uh, room we've missed on the staircase. Uh, disgusting. There's a room on the other staircase um, that we missed. We've been in there. No, we have. It's the um, yeah. To be fair, I haven't taken a photo of that way. That way though. Could light in here. Brilliant. I wonder if the alarm things for those safes are still on. Doubt it, like. Nah, yeah, there's no other power to the rest of the building, so. Like, I, I thought, like, because um, I've buzzed it up a little bit, but see there? Yeah. I was just thinking about like maybe you could call for there, but it's like there's like a load of shelves behind it. I was just trying to think when I was a kid. Yeah. I, I, I don't remember it too much to be honest. With you. Maybe, maybe. It's hard without all the shelves and shit though, isn't it? Yeah, look at that, Whoa, that's fucking mad. Is he gonna, uh... Yeah, it's all boiled up, bricked up, wasn't all that. So I think the roof. That's, that's still jammed. So there's um, so you see this, so you see this building here. Yeah, that's mad. So you see how it is um, like this, and it's and it's this is building the same building as this yeah. until it connects into that. Yeah. There's a roof hatch on that bit there. So it's like past the boarded up zone, but it's the same building that we're in now, yeah. and I think that's the way in. Yeah. And uh, lad, <laughs> if that's the way in. We're fucking, we're actually, oh, brilliant. But because it's a different building, we have to watch out for alarms and sensors and shit in that one. Because he might have alarmed up that side and swerved this side. Oh, 
Uh, I kind of feel like I remember that a little bit, but I feel like they've boarded up there and there. Yeah. It's like because I see the white bit there. I don't remember that white wall bit being there. Yeah. I don't know, maybe. I don't know. I heard some footsteps on the other side of the room. Probably on the floor, but it was. We'll meet with him eventually. And that, isn't that roof higher? <laughs> you right? Yeah, there's the windows there. See that one with a mirror? Just saying if there's any boards here. No. You got a frame now, haven't you? Which you got a bit of a frame, you know, the, the doorway. Yeah, yeah. It's got a big frame on it. Yeah, it's just for the generator, it's a scale. Yeah, that cable's, I think, for a generator, which is a bit bizarre. I don't know what it goes to, maybe power lines. Mate, who recognises the power lines? Because it does go over there, doesn't it? Yeah. And goes around there to. Hey Jaco, you reckon the cables for power lines? No, it will be for the end. It goes to the basement, not to the basement. Yeah, alright. Yeah, that'll be fun. It'll be there, I bet it'll be like this. Hey, look at that stagnant bottle, big bucket of water there. Shit, what's that in the bottom? It's dirt, I think. Maybe it might be like something worse. Yeah, so all blocked off. Yeah, well that's that's. The, yeah, well the roof is the only thing that I, uh, I think you can get in. <sighs> Jacob, you checked out any of the rooms on the far end there? Oh shit, this is um this is where we get in it. No, is it no? Yeah this it is, isn't it? Shit. I did go there. Yeah, but what's this? This ain't the stairs to part one. Oh shit! Come in here. Hey, come in here, it's prime real estate in here, it's proper mad prime property. Actual mad in here. Lad, I'd live in here. Lad, free apartment, love pool. Do you want to spot this place? Yeah, yeah. Is this crazy? Um, yeah, but I don't think no one's going to really care. Virgin money. Wait, what? Mm -hmm. Was there ever a virgin money in this block? I don't think there was, was it? Oh, was it? Oh. Scream on fire to go, whoa. What's that on the wall? 
Um dia você fica É isso, né? Yeah, that's what I was thinking because it curves around, doesn't it? Yeah. Shit, look at this newspaper. When's this from? This looks proper old, this. When's the day in it? Um, 1985. Wow. I just get that with me the old GoPro. What all that one look like? No, <laughs> yeah. it look, look like I'm um, fed up. Yeah. <laughs> a lot of hippie with the uh, thing on there. Shit, very mouldy in there, disgusting. E, I hate it. I just went on the carpet and went <coughs> a little squelch. What's this? Storage. Oh shit. Wait, shit. Man, what the fuck? Oh, that goes outside or something? Yeah. Oh no, oh wait, does that go first be on the ground floor? Yeah. Yeah, because I, I thought it went outside then, I was like, what the fuck? This carpet is disgusting. Scold, scold, scold. Ugh. Fuck them. Shit. Sewing machine? I think. Wow, that's what the fuck. Oh yeah, that's that thing. Wow. 
Not this guy. Oh shit, is that where that stairs go yeah, to? Yeah, yeah. It's actually quite good though. And pretty much in pitch black. Been pretty pitch black that. You know what I mean? Not even that bad. Yeah. Oh shit. Is um is this what, what office would this would in security office or something? Sure. This is the fire fire Proposed art exhibition. Hmm. Oh shit, what? What? Fucking mad that, you can just scroll through your photos like that. Oh yeah. Fucking hell. I have to like individually click. <laughs> on all my cameras. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, no. I am. Sometimes I just don't delete any blue ones until I've got them on the computer. Um, yeah, just basement, isn't it? Been down there. Yeah. Uh. What do you call it? Roof thing. Yeah, yeah, should we try that? Yeah. I'll go up there with a viz. Alright, look like I'm working there. I'll get it unlocked because you need to like um the like they rip the door handle off. So I'm gonna put the keys in there and use that as um Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, anyone lads. This should get us off, I think. Yeah, some of these rooms here we haven't been in yet. Oh, just going to that Hmm. Is that a photo scanner? Looks like, I don't know. I think so. Yeah, photo scanner, I think. There's nothing in here. Around the corner, it's weird, you know. It's just a broom sticking in the, in the corner. It's its own. Right, like mop. It's like weird, isn't it? The angles on it all just didn't make sense to it. Shuttles in here, comes the door out. Toilets. I haven't been in there. Well, sin in there. More toilets. Yeah. Yeah, I know that. I'm used to walking like really long distances, so it's alright for me. The fuck? Yeah. Weird. Men's locker room. Yeah. Alright. We've been down there. Yeah, we've been down all these places, I think. Maybe there's a few places on top on one some of the top floors. Check inside these. Well oh, that's the kitchen that. I'll get one around the corner like that. Oh mate, this is fucking off. Can I get it there? Yeah, go on. It's a stick by fucking hell. Yeah, it'd be like mouldy in there, wouldn't it? Yeah, imagine all like the shit in the pans and all that. 
Oh, hold on. Turn off of it. Look at this, this is the room I was on about we're all shitting. Oh shit. Fucking hell, look at that. I know, it's about 10, like, there's about 10 PCs and that. Shit, what the fuck's up? Sorry. This is all serious, isn't it? Check this. Look at that server case there, there's like 10 PCs. Loads. Oh. Like four, so that. Yeah, it's weird, isn't it? They just left it. What's that? That's cool looking. That's a case of a server. That looks sick. I don't know. I'll take that hey, from a PC at home. Server, then. How, is it, that's like quite a recent server. All the hard drives are still in them. Yeah, I know. Take them out. I'll put them on your PC at home. Oh, better, yeah. Shit. Like, do you reckon there's some proper mad data and that? Or you reckon it's just like Pump. stock? Pump. <laughs> it's just like lifting all stock. And five screwdrivers. Cartridges, there's loads of old teeth cartridges. Have you seen this barcode scanner thing? Or whatever it is. God, this is fucking great, this. Yeah. I know, and it's brilliant. It's actually like a gold mine. I've already said it's got hard drives in the There's always tape cartridges just chucking the shoes for like long term backup. Like that's what you Have they not got tapes in them? Oh, they got tapes in them? Yeah. Fucking hell. That's brand new. But there's down there. There's all writing on them ones. What? Look at that Fujifilm CD or DVD. It's in that. Fucking looks mad, that. A sealed copy of fucking. I'll just swap your cards again. The SD cards in there. Isn't it back? I'm, I'm not sure to be honest. I'm not fucking doing it. Playback time. There's loads of RAM here. Yeah, yeah. loads. How, how many gig? Oh. 256 meg. Yeah. 256. 250. They're all 256. DDR PC 200. <laughs> wow. Fucking useless. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, I want one of those pull an egg, imagine. You're being done for nicking 250 oh, yeah. gig. <laughs> <laughs> megabyte to me in a RAM. <laughs> that's an insane looking little. Oh, is that so hard drive in it as well? Yeah, yeah. God, all these servers. Do you think they'd sell them? Yeah, that is. They're all still plugged in and everything, like, just ready to fucking go. Like, right, no. I'm hot, mate. Yeah, hey, isn't it? Shit, what's this? There's nothing in there. What's, hey, what's this, you know? Is there just a bag full of, like, little things? They are. I was gonna do that look like a weirdo, but... They're SFP push connectors for high-speed data transfer. Wow. Okay, really expensive. Did you know that or did you just read it? No, 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 no. I don't know. I mean, you knew it, it's on the neck. Shit. Careful. It's in this fucking safe. Is there one of them, like, computers in it? It's kind of locked. Beep, 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 beep. These tapes are fucking fresh. Oh, shit. I wonder how much they sell for. Not that much. No, I, I, I guess not. Because it's an old data format, isn't it? I don't think many people would want it. People, it, it's, it's, I think it's really cheap, so people do still use it. Yeah, that. well, that's probably, probably why I don't sell them, because it's really cheap. Yeah, that's true. Probably. Look at that. You get slow internet connection on your PC at home. <laughs> Got a fucking, I don't know. There's, there's like, there's a roof in here. Oh, that's not a knock on the floor. Yeah. Oh, there's a boot here. Yeah, one that you knocked on the yeah, floor. Yeah, someone knocked on the floor. Talk, talk. 
Put that there. Fuse. Breaker. Clean. Hey, Jacob. Hands up. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of regret touching that, it's a bit, bit grimy. That's pretty sick. Has it still got a red light on my thing? Yeah, yeah. Sad. What's that behind it? Repair disc. Oh, so that's, so if, then that might be a, you know, stuff that you go in and repair it. Yeah. God, I think I'll nick this now. <laughs> Put it there and just pick it up <laughs> again. I already had it. The police. Shit, my look at that. The little, um, headphones there. Oh shit, yeah. Then I'll say, oh, there you go. These barcode scanners are actually sick. I know they are, aren't they? It's like, you just like one or two people. Ah, uh, you know, if you were scanning shit in shops, you would actually just want to, like, fucking place yeah. it around and go, <laughs> have a little fucking nerf gun battle with oh, a barcode scanner. Shit. Is that a CCTV camera? God, that's an old key. Imagine if that's on now. I know. <laughs> and, it's, and it's looking at us, and it's like, ooh, it's picking me up. Look <laughs> at <laughs> that old uh, monitor. That's a bit of a shit one. Oh, yeah, yeah. In in what? Which one? Days. Say days, yeah. Like that colour? No, they were grey, but I remember they had them, I remember. I don't I don't remember that. What was that? The Windows two thousand two thousand. Let's get that light coming in it. Shit. Can't see Yeah, George. CLT for you, lad. CLT over there as well, Oh no, that's flat as her flat. Grandad still uses CRT, won't it? Oh, it's like an Xbox It does, doesn't it? Yeah, oh yeah, like an, like a... An early one. Yeah, an early one. Fucking I had the later one, mate. Did you use that? Yeah, yeah, the Winger Death ones. I had, I had the later one. Right? Yeah, I had the later one. Everyone, uh, everyone else had the early one. And I was just like, why does everyone else have like different Xboxes to me? <laughs> oh, shit. It's alright. Oh yeah, is this where you meant? Yeah, that's a special, you know. Oh god, yeah. <laughs> it's disgusting floor. Where is the special? It's, it's open air. That, see the uh, corrugated pa panels? See the corrugated panel? That's um, as a special panel, what? It's outside though, so it should be right. And it looks kind of intact. Yeah, so... See over there? Yeah. So you see that hatch? You can open a hatch and get out on the booth. Yeah. And around the corner, there's another hatch. But that's, you know, the bit that's blocked off? Yeah, it's yeah. past the bit that's blocked yeah, off. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Wow, do you want me to get over there? Uh, oh no, we don't need we, I I can get up through that hatch over there. Can you? Yeah, uh, there's um, a ladder foot. Should we, Should yeah, we take, some, take some photos of them? Yeah. Yeah, go there now, right? Yeah, no. Ah, uh, I think that's the only bit of asbestos in the building. Shouldn't say that. Jinx. I'll, um, is it jinx yourself? Is that saying jinx yourself? Yeah. Jinx. Yeah. It's not. No, it's not jinx. Fuck. What's it? You know when you. You know when you say 
you say, oh, like, um, it's like, oh, it's sunny today, and the next second it's raining. Yeah. What's that called? It's going to piss me off, that's a word for it. Should I do that on? Yeah. Um, I'll go up with me this on that. You just wait at the bottom of the ladder. Yeah. And then I'll come I'll if I get it open I'll come in. I'll shout you as Yeah, Well I'll get I'll go in first, I'll check if there's anything there. Yeah. Because it'll yeah. be a bit of um wait, was it two stairs down? It might be is it this one? Shit. Might be this one, I think. Yeah, this is one. <sighs> Are you ever, did you ever go in this bit? Yeah, yeah. We've been in this today, but... No, but like, you know, when it's open. Oh, I can't remember, to be honest. I, all I remember this place is the cafe. Because the big lights, that's all I remember Yeah, fair enough. I don't remember much to be honest with you. I mean, so you probably remember a bit more than me because you're two years older than me, aren't you? Yeah. Do you remember this, George? Yeah. Right, I'm going to put my vis on. <laughs> Just going to get my vis out here. So you see that ladder there? Yeah. yeah. That ladder's the way up. Oh, sweet. I've been, I've been up there before, so no. I got two visits on me, so. I've got a vis with me. Sounds. George, do you want a vis? Yeah, I can do it. George, yeah, I've got two. You want one? Yeah, You want one, yeah? Yeah. Right, I'll get it out for you. It's a bit of a weird one if you don't mind, but it's alright. This is technically my friend's, but he just gives it me. <laughs> Because he was like, oh, just forget it, just you have it. I've got loads of this, it's probably all about the company name, don't you think? Yeah, yeah, mine, mine, plain. And they're the companies that I fucking wear for. Yeah, we wouldn't want to be working and wearing them, would you? <laughs> Imagine that, like, they've got a phone number on the back of them. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Someone calls up. Hey, this kid's just on the here. Alright. Um. What did a fucking fucking idiot mean? Hey, George lads, if you viz, that's it. Open yeah. that up, yeah. Yeah, just leave it here if you want, and we'll come back here, won't we? Yeah. yeah. So um. So I uh, yeah, I won't forget. It. Um, could you shine the torch up for me when I'm climbing it? Yeah, I'm in pressure as well. Oh, do you? No, um, I'm in pressure. Alright. There'll be toilets on the other side, don't they? Oh. Yeah, sorry. Oh. Shit. So, a bit of a shit ladder climb up, to be honest with Okay. How high vis is this? Very high vis. Alright.
Hey, right. Can you shine the ladder back up? The light up there. Yeah, lead light. So I'm on. Uh, bad news. No. Yeah, it's um. So the lock's been kind of got cut off it already, right? Yeah. I go put my finger in to open it and all that. Uh, and it, and it's like stiff. It goes ah, and it just stops. Oh, nice. And I, I I pulled it a couple of times. It just stops. Yeah. So I think it's on the other side. It's locked and all. Oh, uh, shit else? And I don't think there's any other way of the roof. I checked on the other side, nothing. Uh, no openable window either. Shit else? Yeah, yeah do you want to jump my viz? I'll just hide. You can't. You're out in the open. Oh, yeah. I'll have my viz if you want, lad. It's alright, I'll Alright, sounds. Don't oh, forget that viz on the thing. Yeah, yeah. Because everyone can see you, all the windows are there for the um, opposite building. Yeah. There you go. You've got your work pants on anyway. Yeah. Where are you going? Alright. Can you see it? Oh yeah. Is it coming round that corner? Yeah. yeah, that's where it is. I'll check round the other corner as well. And there's a little ladder and all that. But there's nothing there. There's like a few windows, but you can't even open them or nothing. So, yeah. Yeah. Well, the bottom floor of the building's not abandoned as well. Uh, I don't know what's above there, but it's uh, flannels, isn't it? There's flannels. Yeah, I think I think there'll be people there. Like, looks like it anyway. Hey, look, he's in his work pants, so he shouldn't look too bad. It's mad or just much shit. You just leave like paperwork and all. If you found a way in, yeah. Just get, you just get your finger in there. It's, it just only goes so much. Imagine if he's got it open, lads, and I've just not tried enough. That'd be that. That'd be great. Get in there. Wait, I can see. I can see in the film. Can you? See? Oh shit! Yeah. Must be light coming through the window. Light. Looks like it anyway. Wow, that's fucking insane. I'm gonna go for it right up to it. Yeah, shit, yeah. Yeah, it opens like a little bit and then. And then it like just like locked. It's like, 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 I checked around the other side as well, but there's a ladder, there's a window, but it's all unopenable and there's no, no um, way. Maybe, well maybe it's just like that anyway. Yeah. Because that part, you can see for the wind, it's all, uh, it's all abandoned. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And there's no ladder, you know, if you had a ladder or whatever, you couldn't ladder up anyway. That'd be a good explore, wouldn't it? Yeah. Um, I reckon it'll be like this place, to be honest with you. I think it would just be similar to here. Just because it's going to put my visitors away. It makes sense if it's the bottom floor of it. It's still in use. Yeah, the yeah. Well, not not really. It's Powerland and that's it, isn't it? Yeah. It looks like it's like quite high, that floor as well. It looks like a two-window is the floor.
You know that posed up bit in the alley? There's like a random posed up bit, it's down there, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. 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 Cause I had looked down there, put my head over. Oh. Yeah. I think. Should I have another look in the basement? Because I feel like I could have possibly missed something. Huh? Oh, We've explored it all now, though. Yeah, because there was, there was a board, and I don't think that was for Powerland. I think that was for something else. Yeah, yeah. Is your head aching? Yeah. yeah. Ow. It really hurts, man. I'm going to turn this off a bit. Hello? Hello?
hear, heard a weird noise, might have been an animal or something like that. A lot of spider webs around, I'm not sure if you can see them on camera. There's a few of them that kind of go in the way. This is weird room. After thirst. It's nothing else. what those metal, metal poles are there, that old door, like a, looks like a fire escape type of door, like one of those. It's a fire exit, but there's no exit. It's a bit flooded back here, it doesn't look like there's anything more back here as far as it goes I'm not seeing any spiders down here so far but um, I think I have seen them before and think they're only small ones yeah that's not opening I don't think Out there, we'll just do another. As far as the um, this is part of the basement goes. This is it. this door? Oh yeah, very um, spooky. Basements and stuff, they are very spooky places. And this goes to this door here, which is um, boarded off. And as you can see, there's some light there. So, let's go back to that. Now, obviously, um, I'm not really scared of places like this, but because of how dark they are and stuff, uh, your your um, no your heart rate, my heart rate stays the same, but um, but um, you do feel slightly anxious because it is dark, and um, I think. Evolutionary, evolutionarily, I think that's how humans have developed. We've developed to be um, scared in dark places because because we can't see. Our um, perception has to be on point. So if we're scared, we're um, looking around and we're noticing things more. in here it says no egg no exit again and look at that um wow the old um, intercom I wonder how old that is it looks like um seventies maybe This place is half ransacked, and I think it's ransacked by the people that um, that owned it. Actually, well, there's a map. Uh, 
It's weird how um how they have all these systems here. Wait, look, is that one on? No, it's not on. I thought, I thought it might have been on. But uh it's got the key in it. And the power's off, so it's safe to me for me to do this. But that's what that's what's inside. The power to the whole building's on um I forgot what it says now, but it says um VLA's failed. Whoa. Now I've not been in here and I don't know where this leads. But it's crazy how there is some more stairs here. I'm gonna go down a bit one second. I've came back but if you notice in, if you notice it, it's like well it's fairly clean. If you look in here, there's loads of that shit. So um radio there. So yeah, shit looks in here. Electrical cupboard, fuck. So that's I wanna get into that side of the building but I can't. So much of that shit in here. There's some kind of entrance. Alright, I don't like that. Just heard some little, just a little bit of movement or a little bit of something there. I don't like it because I think, I think there actually might be an old family of rats down there. I don't want to meet them. I know rats kind of keep themselves away. But, um, yeah, it's not, it's not like, um, what you call it to go down there alone. So, um, yeah, I don't know. I'm gonna go down there, but I'm gonna go down there another day with, um, when other people are with me. What? I heard some weird voices there. I'll see. Yeah, voices. You do hear voices down here, but yeah. Right, so I'm gonna go down there because uh, I'm gonna go up here first. The sun's gonna be cloud. Um, so machine. Those messages are on my phone. Okay, they're on my phone. Right.
Where was my room? That's down here. Whoa. So, um, actual piece. Yeah, it looks like it's oh shit. Actual painted canvas. And who's not who that stun boy? She's going for um, an interesting style. I wonder what these things were, I wonder what was put in here. Maybe rapid display cases. Please pay here. Where's the cashier at? It's not, they're not here. How am I meant to pay? The cashier's not here. It's quite empty, so I'm sweetened up. <laughs> Um, little door thing here. It's a little odd. There's railings up there. Wait, wait. Little cupboard. Close the door behind me. Look at them little keyboards there, strange. Little trackpad, little ball thing there as well. Like the font is using that. Well, here's the thing about urban exploring. So here's the thing about urban exploring. So um, when you're in these places and stuff, there's always weird things lying about. And in this one, it's it's um, you probably shouldn't film these because of um, because that's someone's private information data. Uh. Strangely, got some stairs go over the top. So the thing about this place is, um, it's kind of been a. It, no one's got got in. No um, gypsies got in. No vandals got in. Uh, you know, no one's got in it. Destroyed it. I mean, it's all um. You know, pretty much how they left it, and I think a lot of it is ransacked actually by the people that owned it and they were just ransacking you know and um getting any valuables out and stuff like that but to be fair they've lot left a lot of valuables behind uh probably maybe because um they couldn't be bothered trying to sell sell them all on the in there there's nothing maybe it was a flat screen in that <laughs> doubt it You've got all these um, things here. I think inside here is like catalogs or something. Oh, I just tripped. Yeah, they're like um, display, the things you put into displays. And then this one, they have like little. Um, little uh, book of things you can buy like Argos catalog and that's all for this room <laughs> the 
left out folder, obviously. I'm going to take the lift. Okay, so, um, so this is the basement level. So up there is the ground level, you can see. This is the basement level. Don't know I've been there, I don't know. There's nothing in here though. Sometimes that's what you get, sometimes there's nothing, sometimes there's something. Yeah. Is that people's phone numbers? You shouldn't film that. I know it's probably outdated and stuff, but still. If you look in these um, walls here, like it looks black, and that's not because there was a fire or anything like that, that's mould. So not very good for your lungs. And that's another danger of urban explorer if it's exploring. Uh, sometimes it's worth investing in a mask, depending on the places you're in. But um, if you walk past it, or you know, stay in these places for not too long, see how the roof is a bit mouldy as well. Uh, and, not, and stay in these places for not that long, then um, you know the effects don't tend to be um, severe. So here's the um, here's the basement basement. So this is uh, underneath the um, shop floor basement. Um, there's an England flag there. Saint George's flag. The ladder. It's flooded down here, and there's an engine or a lift machine or something like that over there. Which is um, just interesting on this um, inspection, inspection 32518. Don't know what that machine does because, um, but it looks very interesting. Little meter thing there. Oh, it's like a weird dishwasher. I don't think it is though. Um, and um, a lot of the fun of this is also um, you also find out quite a lot of stuff. The mold grown on that, which isn't good. Now, I've been that way, but I haven't been through that door there. Completely missed it. Last time I was here, so oh, it's shut. I right, just pop I and don't want to touch it because uh, in places like this, you kind of want to touch the least amount of things as possible, just because it is dirty and you don't know you don't know what's happened to it. And here we've had a, an accident. This is health and safety risk. All right, so um. It is oil, I think, and obviously it's gathered a bit of a film over the t over time it's been here. Because there's a big dome like light things, I think. Be cool. Another weird machines, gadgets, fans. Something weird on there. It's a camera there. Alright, and this bit is a uh, is flooded. So uh, I have got to walk through shoes on this occasion. You know, this water, you don't want to be touching it. You don't want to be um, coming into contact with it. Um, could hear a very weird sound there for pigeon. So this is a, a big room. You see the rust there. <coughs> yeah. I'm gonna get some fresh air in a bit. <laughs> My lungs ain't enjoying this. Go down in a second, because I need to film this way. So yeah, uh, obviously you have to be you have to be aware of the dangers of these places because the way uh See, I'm in the in the what now? So um, here's this room. You can see here. 
some mat I could stand on here. Some um, electrical equipment here. Some electrical equipment here. And then uh, here there's, um, there's like a lift machine and you can see the pulley there. So I don't know why I'm not an expert on lifts. Oh, that looks painful. <laughs> I'm not an expert on lifts or anything like that, but I don't really know why there's a lift pulley in the basement. But maybe this was a big lift, maybe it was a big lift and it needed an extra pulley in the basement. Just just because the ones in the uh, in the roof weren't sufficient enough. And here again you have two more big what you call it. And here it looks very dangerous because it's a well it's just an isolated for lift. But you've got these big switches and they're all turned on and the uh, power is off but I'm, I'm actually not going to switch that but the power is off mm, to this and i will prove that in a second and otis sells the company that makes the lifts so um with when you're like you know the difference between like going into this place when it's open and having a look around and coming into when it was a when it's like this state and having a look around is you get to see a lot more. Look at that. Don't know how deep that goes, but because uh, it's flooded there, there's a big cargo lift, I think. And, um, Right, so we got that. Just being an idiot. A uh, shadow's go. Anyway, here's, here's another um, pulley for a lift or something like that. Another one of those danger, painful signs. Um, yeah, very, um, you know, you've got that yellow thing there for, um, I guess, like, you know, warning, don't bump your head. Pit ladder, do not remove. Pit ladder. Oh, that must um, be a ladder. For lift pit. There's a lot of um, health and safety information there. And there's also, is that inspection? No, that's control of um, substances hazard hazardous to health. So that must be the oil that they use to lubricate lifts. Um, oh, here's another cargo lift. And uh, it's that's the big one. So I don't really know where this one goes. And he goes down to the secret nuclear bunker, which doesn't exist. I don't know what that is, but it's some kind of um, spray, it says. Nature's, fi nature's finest range spray floor, ma floor maintenance. So it must be something to do with cleaning up the floor. Christmas decorations from Christmas time. We're back in this room again. Oh, well, before I forget, I'll show you down, down here. There's a ladder there. So, in here, it's just some storing some things, bits and bobs. There's two rooms there which are locked and it looks like someone's punched through to see what's on the other side and I'm not sure if that's a vandal or the people that worked here but I guess in that case the people that worked here would be my guess. And there's up those stairs. It goes all the right way to the top floors of the building. In here is a little bit flooded as well and uh, no entry, authorised personnel only. I actually, actually do close this. Alright, I'm going to do that again. So there's the stairs. And there's a um, door here. E, fuck that. There's the stairs. The door here, it goes in here. 
and um, this is the storing uh, things to make shelves with in here. So this is you know the shop shelves. This is how they you know they assemble them out of these, put them together. And here it says um, big red door. Big. It's a big wooden, heavy red door here with a roller at the top with a metal bar. It says no entry authorized personnel only. And obviously I am authorized personnel. Film a documentary after all. I did slam it a little bit there. We go into this place. And this is a interesting room. So this is the boiler room, I think. Uh, or something like that. Or it used to be a boiler, boiler room. So there's a weird box there, which I don't know what it is. Uh, and there's, um, there's a bit there that's uh, screwed, screwed shut with, um, with screws. <laughs> And there's all these pipes here that I've got that are insulated. Hope there's not asbestos there, but if there is asbestos, it will probably have set old light. But I wouldn't go around touching stuff like that. It does look kind of a bit asbestos -y, but it might, it might just be fiberglass. Um, so here we've got a big vent, big ventilation things, and they don't actually use big ventilation things in this room. They don't connect anything, so this room isn't for ventilation. But uh, you can see how big those are. You can literally, not in calling them, you can crouch a little bit, like this height. You could, you could, you could get in with that height. So the very big vents. And here we got uh, these big um, things here, and it says on them, it says Manchester Clarify Clarifiers Ltd. It's a nice, a nice little um, thing on that. And it's underneath it's a John Lewis asset. So these were back when when this place used to be John Lewis. And you've got these big um, poles here with the, with the black and yellow to, to make sure people notice them and notice like, you know, there's a pillar so you don't bump into it. Because you can get in the way and uh, this is quite a bit of a dark room, but obviously it did it used to have lights in it. So these are clarifiers and um, a little pressure thing there. So I don't really know what clarifiers do exactly. Another thing there, but they've got um, these hoses here at the bottom, and there's a tap at the bottom there which connects to the hose. And I think there's there is clarifiers that do with treatment plants, so maybe it's got something to do with um, with treating the water coming into the building or something like that. But I don't really know. Uh, or maybe it's to do with uh, some kind of gas or something. But while well, you know. But maybe it's not as liquid because of the ho the hose pipe. But I do not know. Um, I will research it later and tell you. So here's um, pressure gauges. You got these uh, big pumps here. These dual uh, motors, and the uh, you've got the radiator thing thing there, and they're, and they're going in the spin around. Whatever's in this pipe's getting pumped pumped along using that. Got two valves there to um, control how much gets through or or stop it getting through or shut it. You know, another pressure gauge there. Um, so I'm guessing these things used to be pressurized. They look like they were pressurized. Maybe this is um, for hot water. That's an idea, isn't it? There's a weird little thing in the wall there, which interesting duty selector and yeah there's some um, very maser pipes going on and more pressure gauges and stuff like that which is really interesting you've even got like a little mask there it's a really interesting room very um pipey and over here i noticed that so there's a bit that's boarded up with there, which I don't know what that is. I don't know what that weird pipe is that ends suddenly and then comes out into that. It goes down there, that thing. I don't know where, how far that goes. If we get over here, it's um. So that thing is connected. Oh, that's connected to something else. But um, there's this other electrical conduit that comes down here, and that's connected to um emergency stop. It looks like. 
you can kind of see behind that metal thing that's blocked off, but don't really know what it is. But maybe it's for so if someone's above there, they can load stuff down into it easier. And here you can see like what looks to be um, bricks, debris, coal, and it's like a, a big white shutter. And I think I think what that is is it's um is that some somehow connects to the the alleyway. It connects to an alleyway. And um, people back in the day, they would um, they would have coal shoot, and uh, they would put the coal down there. And the coal will go down there, and then um, and then they used to those clarifiers. They used to be big uh, furnaces there, uh, coal furnaces, and they'll put the coal in there, and that would be used to boil the water for the building. And you know that would be used for the hot water instead. So but we're back in this room again. <laughs> Built some more of those things there. So this bit over here is a bit flooded as well, but it's it's nothing my shoes can't handle. Uh but again, right, this is um this is uh, I've already been down here, right? And I was going much slower. So um I'm already relatively aware of the dangers that that there are. Okay, that fire escape there, for the fire escape, actually leads here. Lighting stock room. So that there, that room there was a, a stock room for the lighting. So, so the floor above and the shop floor, the basement level of the shop floor, that actually was um that was for lighting, the lighting department for the Razor, and you see here it's mold. Believe it or not, that white cotton candy stuff is mold. And it's very, very it is hazardous to your lungs, and you won't want to breathe that stuff in. So um, let's walk past that bit quite quick. So here we got um, health and safety. The abrasive wheels regulation again. Um, stop, start. But all this um, stuff here. Don't know what's in there. And in this room, if you're good quiet, you can hear home. And the home's got coming from, from this here. Like asbestos hazard. So this must be um must be asbestos uh, used as a isolator or something like that inside this big machine here. So we won't we won't um won't mess around with that anyway. Cause uh yeah. And there's on top of here there's all fuses, which are really big fuses. Look at that one there. Very big fuse for um for this. For this contraption, which it looks like something to do with um, something like uh, to do with the power or something. Obviously, it's to do with the power. Uh, visor one fuse removes. I'll ask my electrician friend because you will know. And over here, there's um, is this big machine here, and this is actually for the ventilation. Is actually for the ventilation this room so you've got this big motor big a big motor here and it drives around this uh, belt you can see there the belt and then it drives a big drum which I guess there's a, a big fan in it so um so over there must be some kind of air shaft some kind of event some some kind of thing in the wall there and it comes down here, and then it gets pumped throughout the building there. Or maybe it goes the opposite way, and it's for the bad air out. I don't, I don't know. And again, if we open this, we can actually have a look inside it. So see that black thing there? That looks like um, a filter. So that's, um, so that's where they filtered uh, the mucky air, right? I'm not sure from what, what, what side it picked it up because I'm not sure which side the motor would have been spinning. And 
pumping the air in and there is another looking filter thing inside that so we'll close that up we'll um, leave it how we'll leave it how we got here a differential pressure switch so there, must, so there might have been a difference of pressure because of the fan there spinning uh, so there would have been more air would have been going from one side to the other so there might be a difference of pressure on the other side so there's another weird shaft looking thing There's a mirror, and here is actually, here's the technician coats for the technicians that work down here, and uh, that's what they would have wore while fixing it, so they didn't, so their clothes didn't get, um, you know, had the least amount of chance of getting trapped in the machinery. And here's another motor, and it's, um, and I'm not sure if it's mounted to the, to the ground there, it might be. But um, it, this might actually be just a spare motor for, for that. So if that one breaks down, they have a replacement they can just replace it with. Or that might be the old one, and they've just put it here and not, not taken it out. And there's a hook at the top, which must be um, for lifting it with a hook, a hoop at the top. So that has a hoop at the top, and that must be for lifting it with a hook. And here is a, I don't know what this is, but this is an interesting looking thing. Very uh, beautiful and um, a lot of detail in it. Uh, a lot of the detail in, in the, um, in that. And it's, that's boarded up and I'm pretty sure I know where that goes. Pretty sure we actually went there. Goes to the other side of the basement. You've got isolated boxes here. And this looks like, um, a cupboard for spare parts and stuff like that. There's um there's a fuser, so air handling unit in this room. So super pump for lifts. So sump pump, super pump, sump pump for lifts. So sump pump is um is a pump that uh pumps out water, I think. So it pumps out groundwater um to keep a place from flooding. So if we looked in that lift before and it was flooded a little bit and there was water. The, the sump pump uh, it would have been the pump that um that that would have pumped all that water out now my torch is running low but i've got my phone on me so i could use that other torch but um still it's not ideal so here i was looking at this uh, and these are all british plugs but of different amps and some of them are pre-1950 that's what my ele electrician friend said when when we did this this explore together which there'll be clips of this in the documentary as well and there's, a, there's some keys there. Just have a little number on it. And they were made in Birkenhead. Fair enough. Liverpool Birkenhead, apparently. Even though that doesn't exist. Uh, so yeah. So um, and these must have been for testing, uh, testing broken equipment, broken stuff like that. So that's, that must have been what well, that, that's um, for testing stuff. So they have all different types of plugs because things, you know, have different types of plugs. So they need to test it and see if it's working still. And I probably should be a bit more quiet in here. Because if you listen, there's footsteps above my head, which are people in palm on above me. You see, there's, some, there's all kind of fuses on top of there. This is a fuse shelf, I think. There's a big saw there, and there's a gear oil. This looks quite old, that, doesn't it? Very um, vintage, very vintage um, gear oil. But that might have lasted them, lasted them a bit, to be honest. Or maybe you just kept topping it up. Um, so here you can see the desk, what they used to work and repair stuff on, stuff on. And we have a clock, we have some random light kind of fixture looking thing there. We have um, all these holes in the desk for drill, drill holes and all sorts of things like that. We have some kind of weird gas um, cylinder there. We have all these earth wires and wires and stuff like that.
And here, if you turn this off, look. So this is on, right? And this is just the um so so here is um dangerous asbestos, do not disturb, blah blah blah, right? Do not cut pen penetrate any surface uh, or touch any item. So um as I was saying, asbestos is only dangerous if it's messed with. So it's talking about do not cut or penetrate uh any surface just because just because it might have asbestos in it. And this is actually the it's a GH Lee, just I think this thinks the name of the building we're in. And this is a substation underneath the building. And it's on, if you can hear it. Alright. So um BT open reach there for Ethernet cable. And this is on there, it says battery warning. Right, and it says uh, import. All right, so and it says phase failure, so it's getting three meter three nine oh seven ten uh what's that kilowatt per hour? So that's uh, the input. I think import it says. I think that's what's going in, and it's a phase failure. So there's no, and I'm not sure if this is to do with the um this to do with this, or is this is to do with the, the substation. I'm guessing this has actually got to do with with this over here. So there's a phase failure, right? So that means there's no power coming out of this thing. So um, here we got, um, yeah. So this is the sign of this place not being touched for years and years and years. Because if you see that, there's loads and loads and loads of copper inside this cable here. I'm not sure if I'm actually gonna put this into my documentary or not. Because if you don't know, copper is a very, very, very expensive, right? So like, so it's very, very, very expensive copper. So that there, right, the whole thing, probably, probably worth a couple grand, right? And if you think about how easy that would be to just kind of bring some kind of cutter type things down here and just cut all those off and just sell them, like, like uh, in chunks, then um, yeah, there's already people that have got chunks off copper there um so that's the sign of this place not being touched because those should be nicked by now and i'm not sure if i'm even going to put that in my documentary or not because um because i don't really want, want people to come here and nick stuff and destroy it and and i'm already going to keep it quite secretive location I'm not going to tell you the location of this place and off like that even though some of you might recognize it well, now this is interesting because this is um, drawings and plans. So if you look in here, oh, there's a family photo there. Wow, huh? That's very really cool, actually. Wonder how old that is. Uh, that's a really bizarre place to find a family photo. There's actually a secret wall behind there and a crawl space. So you don't know where that goes, that looks very weird. Um, but there's that, these uh, drawings, plans, schematics for this um, for this building, which is G H Lee Building. Which uh, I forgot what it stands now for now, but uh, I will say. So um, here, here you got it on um, on tracing paper. It looks is it? Yeah, it's tracing paper. They've got all the plans on tracing paper so they can um, make copies by hand, which is quite an old thing. You see all the plans there, the kind of schematics, engineering schematics. We did these in a, when I did engineering last year. We, we learned how to draw all these and we learned how to um, set them all out and stuff like that. Um, So yeah, just plans. Yeah, just plans. Uh, I just oh, I can't I can't put that on place. So I'm gonna just take a photo of that, right? Uh, in a second, I, I'll just if there is files and stuff like that. I don't want to film these just because they might have sensitive information on them, right? 
and I wouldn't want that to be on here. So here is a room just full of rubbish. I'm not going to show this room. I'll show this room from the other clips.